Audrey Anastasi was born in the Jewish faith, but in her career as a painter, she constantly returns to one subject. I've always wanted to paint the Stations of the Cross. Her husband Joseph is a practicing Catholic, and they would walk the Stations of the Cross together. It's a comfort in a way to look at this dignity, this, this example of dignity under horrific cruelty. Her paintings and her background would inspire artist and curator Anders Knutson to create his own exhibit on the Stations, created by 14 Brooklyn artists of all different faiths. The story is a story, but the images go deeper, I think. They make it very personal and very universal. Each artist was allowed to pick the station they would interpret. Among the works are Audrey's and Joseph's. He tells me of an immediate connection to the first station when Jesus was condemned. We all carry a cross, and this was a case of betrayal. And to feel what he was going through, I wanted to make it like we were first person, that we were witnessing what Jesus was witnessing. The stations include all different techniques and forms of art, ranging from traditional to the abstract. The unknown helper, the blood, obviously, the, this tremendous cross that is overwhelming Jesus at the time. That was in my mind and in my heart mm -hmm. uh, when I painted this painting. But no matter what approach they take, the artists feel a deeper connection to the story of Jesus. I was able to get deeply into the the feelings, the emotions. What it does is it, it shows us that we all have the ability to look beyond who we are and to actually take, take on what, whatever forces are out there. The artwork will be displayed until Easter Sunday at the Church of Incarnation on Madison Avenue near 35th Street. Reporting for Currents, I'm Katie Angusser.